three, two, one. All right, you want to go down? Is that what you want to do? Yeah. Man, that sh gave me yesterday. Man, that sh gave me still an all motherfucking night. You know, Mr. Charles, you know, I like to help you, but you got to help yourself. You know what I'm saying? What you talking about, man? You know, Mr. Charles, I like to help a damsel in distress. A damsel? You see it? This is a trap me. This is a trap me. Yes, sir. Back with another one. Man, before I get into it, man, I want to give all the thanks, man. I just hit 1500 a little bit over 1500 You know what I'm saying? We're going to keep running it up, running it up. You know what I'm saying? This one, the day, man, we got a crazy situation, man. You know how these young girls be that can't control their emotions and stuff. You know what I'm saying? And um, she got her so-called sugar daddy that she taking through hell. Because she putting that good cat on them. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to go ahead and dive off into it. But before I dive into it, make sure you like that. Make sure you comment that. Make sure you subscribe now. Man, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man. Hit the notification bell so you can get everything, man. So we can run it up. Run it up. On February 27th, 2022, Cobb County Police responded to a call regarding a disturbance in the lobby of the building at Vining Lofts and Apartments in Atlanta, Georgia. According to the security officer on duty, a heated altercation had broken out between a male and a female. Witnesses reported that the female was physically attacking the male and even resorted to throwing a heavy metal decorative ball at him. Two male witnesses stepped in and managed to separate the fighting couple. The male was then able to retreat to his apartment, locking the door to keep the situation from escalating further. Fellas, man, stay away from the women. That need to get beat on to feel like they they loved. You know what I'm saying? Like the great words of Soldier Slim. If I gotta beat you, then I don't need you. Let the next man do it. You done ran me away from you now. How you gonna prove it? Man, don't be going to jail behind no cat, man. That girl wanna be fighting this stuff, man. Kick her to the curb, bro. Kick her to the curb. Because we ain't, we ain't doing that, man. You put your hands on me, I'm gone. You'll never see me again. Like, I don't, we ain't even to play that. You know what I'm saying? Fellas, have standards for yourself, man. Did y'all see what happened? So what, what happened? Did you call? I didn't call. He came to my car and he said, I'm having a situation. I said, what's the matter? And I saw her walk up to Where is he at? He may be in his apartment. Back to okay. Yeah. I, got you. Um, I told him to go upstairs. Yeah. Um, and she, kept, I saw her trying to get in. And when people were walking in, she said, well, I forgot my key. And the next thing I know, he's in my car telling me that she's going crazy, begging on the and stuff like that. Okay. And when I came to the door, she was in there, and then she was like, I'm not leaving. I said, man, you have to leave. She said, I'm not leaving, and she took her jacket off, and she went with her. She fought him, and she fought She was him. fighting Mark? She was fighting Okay. Mark. Do you know if, um, did she break anything? She didn't break anything. Did she ever have any, like, weapons in her hand? She had the weapon that uh, one of the officers had given her. With, like, a little piece of table? And she was walking around with this big book on her. Okay. Walking around with it. Yeah, because she was holding it when he came out. Oh, boy. Do you know where the... And another thing, man. If y'all got y'all... You know what I'm saying? You got something going on. A lot of these places, they'll kick you out. You got all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Going on. You know what I'm saying? People calling the police. People... You'll get kicked out for your guests. You know what I'm saying? So, don't be around here having these wild chicks. I know that. That cat might be good. You know what I'm saying? But you can't, man... Stay away from them, bro. Stay away from them. Table is that she broke? I don't know that she broke the table. Oh, okay. She okay. took that off of the table. Oh, she okay. was trying to get out of the door, but it, it, she didn't know the press to bring it back. In. Yeah. And then she went around the other side. Mm -hmm. She attacked him two or three times. In here. Did she have a car here? No, she called. She actually called somebody a few minutes ago and said, "Troy, you better come get me because I'm going to jail." So I don't know how she got it. Okay. And these two gentlemen, they were walking in this month and said, can you help me because I can't restrain her anymore. He did try to restrain her because she knocked this back. Yeah. All right. And they helped me. Okay. They didn't hurt her. I got you. Um, do you have idea? I'm sorry. Do you have your idea on you? No, it's in the front. I got That's, you. I got you. Hey, it's okay. Uh, what's your first? Oh. And then, okay. And, uh, so you're still screwed for this? Okay. Tower eyes are Okay. Just hang out. Um, I'm back to the Hang out. Thank you.
Yeah. Actually, do you guys have your IDs on you? Do yeah. you guys have your IDs on you? No, I left no. in the house. I was working out. Okay. So you guys, um, what happened? Like, did you see her fighting, Mark? Uh, really, just the man was restraining her. That boy already tell somebody he been working out. You got your ID? No, I left it at the house. I was working out. He ain't asked you what you working out. He ain't asked you that. So she don't hit me. So he right. don't hit her. But that's all I really saw as much. Okay, so, so we're, we're trying to help out. So you're just kind of restraining her? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, what's your first name? Awesome. Okay. And so you saw her and Mark kind of tussling and you guys just restrained her? When I came in, I was just holding her and we just came in and tried to guard, you know. So this you is, this is, how you said this is the situation? The feud kind of de-escalated? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. sounds good guys. Just hang on, okay. Thanks. Thank you. Yeah, we need to stop. Hey, do you have any weapons on you? No weapons. All right, drop that on down. Drop that. Your phone on the ground. Okay. What happened? What happened was... I got into a confrontation with a younger man that lived in this apartment. Is this what you It was a decoration that I just picked up. Okay. Wow. It was a decoration that I just picked up, and he had some things in my property that I wanted out. Where do you live at? With him. Here. How long have you been living? Um, for as long as I can remember. Hey, I see you bobbling. Do you need to like sit down or something like that? No. Okay, then what else happened? Basically, he didn't want to let me in. So I went berserk, but that's not my fault. He's a 50 something year old woman, guy dealing with a 21 year old girl. I told him how, how my emotions are and how I can be hurt sometimes. And when I'm hurt, it turns ugly. Boy, if that wasn't enough red flags for you, my boy, I don't care how old you is. That was red flags though. She told you how her emotions Man, I don't give a fuck if you crazy or not. I'm bringing that shit to my house. You know what I'm saying? Like, that boy 50, 50 what's that, 50 something, 51? She 21? She throwing that cat on oh, him, boy. I mean, put his head to sleep. I mean, he feeling like rejuvenated, like, oh, that one of them, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit. Do you understand that? Nah, I get what you're saying. So what, what else happened? Nothing happened. I didn't hit him or nothing. I mean, you know. Y'all get out here? Got a weapon or whatever. That's it. Okay. Did you break anything? Did you hit anything on the No. Okay. I would never do that to him. I'm an angel. That's why he fucks with me. He gives me all his money throughout the month. Thousands and thousands of dollars. Boy, Mark, if you hear that now. She using you, my boy. She talk about you give you give her all your money. And then bit it crazy. Give your money to a bit that ain't crazy that still got some good cash. You can still get you a young one. Get one that ain't crazy though. You know what I'm saying? She probably listened to sexy red. I, I bet. Ski. Nah, we ain't doing that. You know, he my shirt bag. Okay. He takes very good care of me. What's your last name? Um, my last name. How do you spell it? She look at you like a chat, though. It's my birthday. You don't happen to have your ID in your jacket, do you? No. You don't have it on you at all, do you? Hello. 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 Yeah. 
Uh, I'm gonna try to make it home to you as soon as possible. I don't know how that's gonna happen. But um, right now I got one, two, three, four cops in front of me right now trying to figure out what's going on. And I'm trying to tell them the truth. She ain't talking no goddamn about it. She must be trying to call Mark. He ain't answer for her ass. He tired of her. He on, he on his last straw with her ass. Like, girl, you crazy as hell. You ain't talking to nobody. You leaving a voicemail. Because I, I, I lost it. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what Y'all good? Y'all trying to come out? Yeah, I'm looking for somebody. Oh. I mean, the place is not invincible. People can go in and out. There's no such thing as security. Officers proceeded to the male's apartment to speak with him, but their attempts to make contact went unanswered. Call me when you're ready to go. See, now you can't be changing it around on that man now. Because you probably manipulating him too with that cat. You know what I'm saying? It's an even exchange. He paying your bills, you giving him some cat. But you adding all this extra to it, you over here doing all this disturbance at the man's residence. You know what I'm saying? Now his neighbors looking like, damn, you got this crazy bitch over here. You know what I'm saying? Like, nah. Come on now, you got to play your part. Don't be trying to say he manipulating you and he love you. Yeah, he love you when he, when he up in that thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, he probably don't really love your ass because you're immature. You know what I'm saying? They, they be saying women, they mature faster, but not not nowadays. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't give up. Like, they just just want you for, for the resources. Okay, so as far as tonight, what happened? Like, this whole Okay, thing? what happened was earlier, if you would look at the cameras, he had invited me into his home. He opened the door, invited me in, he had nice mimosas over there. When I left, my tire completely blew out on the highway. So I called my... So, right now you're admitting to them that you're drinking and driving. You're drinking mimosas, and then your tire blew out. How your tire blew out after you were drinking if you weren't driving? You know what I'm saying? That was my, that's just my thoughts. Not for help, because he's my sugar daddy, and he was supposed to help me. He didn't really want to do nothing about it, so I decided to come up here in the front now. Why don't you help me? I just lost my life. I almost lost my life. See, you being dramatic. You coming, see, you coming over there to confront this man on why he ain't come help you. That probably wasn't his position. You got that man playing certain roles. You know what I'm saying? He probably, you already probably maxed him out that month. He like, I'm getting tired of this bitch. I'm going to just hit her one more time. You know what I'm saying? And kick it to the curb because they be getting too expensive. You probably asked for too much. Now you just making it seem like you probably weren't even treating the man right. Yeah, he's my sugar daddy and all this hell. You can't do it like that. Now you, come on now. I know y'all women got more finesse with that. I ain't going to say this for all y'all women because some women out here finessing. You know what I'm saying? And they, they treating it good. He feel like a king. That's how you, that's how you supposed to do it if this man paying for everything. Treat him like a king. Talk shit about him to your, you know what I'm saying, to your friends or behind his back. But while you're around him, treat him like a king. Don't be coming acting crazy and stuff, though. 
Yeah, he's just a simp. As a little bitch. Now you just talk. See, that man with nothing but a check to you. You know what I'm saying? You mad because the check had done bounced on you. You know what I'm saying? He said, I'm tired of this shit. Now you mad. You gonna miss out on all this good, this good shit. Nah, that man, yeah, he said he finna get him another young one that's gonna be a little cheaper. Or he might even want to spend a little bit more because she's gonna be more nicer. And then when you came up to confirm, like, how did that go? I told him I wanted to talk, and he was like, well, I'm just going to call the police. I said, we're going to call the police, and that's when I went ballistic. Okay, and then when you went ballistic, what happened? I picked up a That was right, Mark. Call the motherfucking police, man, because they have been to set your ass up. You already looking out for her. She mad that you could drink, come help her with no time. Shit, you 57 years old. I know you got AAA. That's what I use, AAA. I know how to change the tire. But if I pay for AAA, guess who I'm going to call? To change that tire. AAA. It don't make me more manly because I don't change the tire. Or I didn't change it. I'm going to call AAA. That's why I pay for that for. Why not let these people do their job? It, I cannot risk my life on the side of the expressway trying to change it. And these people got the, you know what I'm saying, the little turn blinker and all, like, move over. Like, I'm going to use AAA. I don't care what you say. Y'all, If y'all ain't use AAA, let me know in the comments. But I'm going to use AAA. It's only like $50, a, $50 for a year. And you get some benefits with it. I picked up an object. I tried to throw it at him. I did not throw it at him. 31. I picked up an object. And I tried to throw it at him. Listen. You just said you weren't trying to throw it at him. And then you said you picked up an object and th and tried to throw it at him. Girl, you should have just went to wherever the hell you live at and not to that man house causing the confusion. Because now he, you probably done missed out on your check. You don't miss that on the chat. I'm telling you, it's only so much craziness a nigga could deal with. Because everybody was holding me back. Which object? Was it that object? It was the little ball. That was that one right there, that metal ball? Yeah, yeah metal. Okay. That's the one I Metal. Yeah, yeah, that actually hit him. Do you remember? No, I didn't hit him with the ball. You just threw it at him? Yeah. Okay. Crazy. Let me see Okay. Where's the person I called? Right over then what happened with that? Came in here six deep. That's what happened. Then after using the ball, we just basically did not figure out what happened. A lot of times we sold the ball. Eventually, we can find So the, the money is the power, like I say, money is power. But I don't think he was really on no control shit with you, because you crazy as hell. He probably just wanted some some young cat. Yeah, I know you doing tricks that women his age ain't doing. So that's all that was. It was even exchange. Now, nah, don't be trying to make it seem like it's something that it wasn't. He, he ain't take advantage of you. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, he ain't take advantage of you. Mercedes Benz. Guess who was calling me back the next day to fuck? Him. So, come on now. We saw it coming. See, that's some crazy shit. I know that shit good. Cause that's how I be with them crazy ones. You can't even let them go. She doing all this stress to you, man. About to take you out. You probably got about a good 20 more years of your life. She finna narrow it down. Cause she gonna be stressing you the hell out. She's about slicing all your tires and all that. Tire, brand new tires be expensive now. We ain't talking about the, the used tire. We talking about brand new tires now. They be expensive. Can I get my shit off the fucking ground? Would you like to check it for weapons? Yeah, I'll check it. Give me one second. 
it ain't a lonely script, right? So they ain't trying to send you a deal with me. I know he ain't trying to send you a deal. So, the best hey, he ain't shut up and listen to me. I don't give a I don't That boy came, hey. That boy came with all the smoke. Mean the business. He now that's the power that's finna be over your ass. You know what I'm saying? And he ain't finna take advantage of you, but that's the power right there. And they ain't even no money. That's your power. He finna definitely come with the power for your ass. Cause they they the difference between you going home and going to jail. Going to jail, going home. Shut up and listen to me. You have bad dreams. Shut up and listen to me. You have bad dreams. I don't give a shit. Shut up and listen to me. Even worse. That boy said, shut the fuck up. Hey, he said, you talking about using the white man for his money? I ain't going to say it's about that, but that, it's just funny to say that. You know, race shows be the best one. But anyways, he like, boy, you going to use one of my fellow? That could be my father. Bitch, shut up. I'm, I'm going to be the power over your ass now. You're going to get off the fucking property and you're not going to fucking come back. Got it? If you come back, you're going to jail. Simple as that. Right. Cool, so get the fuck off the property. Go. Get the fuck off. Go. If you don't leave now, take <laughs> Hey! That one want all the smoke. That one said get the fuck off the property. I I ain't need playing. Like and he, and he got that little strong stance like holding his vest. Bitch, I'm ready to take your ass to jail now. Get the fuck off the property and don't ever fucking come. Don't you ever come back. Ever fucking come Simple as that. Go. Let me put my jacket on. Go. You can do it while you're walking. Go. Five, four. I'll treat you like a child. Five. Boy, not not the countdown. Boy, you know when they get the get the one, your ass in trouble. Your ass in trouble when they get the one. If your parents ain't never do the countdown, my parents ain't never do the countdown. They were just just getting hit, you know that. But if they ever did the countdown. Just know it, it ain't going to be good when you get the one. Oh, oh, why? why did you do that? Why did you do that? You just made everything way worse. He was already coming with the smoke. He, he was that asshole caught. And you going to try to knee that boy in the ball. I, I don't know. I think it might have connected. You going to knee that boy in the balls? Man. <laughs> All right, all right. Did she have on some Tims? Now that would have been funny as hell. She would have had on some Tims, cause boy, that bit was. I mean, six deep, and they they definitely wrestled with her little little skin ass. No, my piercing. Well, I got double piercing. On your stomach. You think they care about your piercings? You just tried to knee that man in the balls, man. You you brave, you brave. Huh? I had my car. Oh, I got something in my car back down there. You got the small cups? Yeah. I was leaving. Right, you gotta get them. Yes, I was. I was picking up my keys. What? I was picking up my car keys so that I can go. You were playing games. I was picking up my car keys so that I would go. I would never come back. I promise. See, that be the problem, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want to talk all crazy. Until the police put their hands on your ass. When they put their hands on you, now you want to act all nice and shit. I'll, I'll never come back. You should have did that. If you ain't going to have the same energy once they put their hands on your ass, don't start with that shit. Just be nice. You know what I'm saying? Like, just get the hell on. But if you want to keep that, he 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 will finna let you go. You want to play games because you felt like, oh, he's in power now. He I don't like how he talked to me. Motherfucker, now you're going to jail. Now you're going to jail. It was funny though, cause after she said that was the um, she got the best pussy that that man never had. That boy was like, he walked up talking all that shit, like shut the fuck up, like man, that pussy is whack as hell. Don't 
Hey, that was a problem. Whack as hell. Mm -hmm. I'm more Sending body work down in 30 seconds. Body work down canceled. I didn't go to my car quick enough. I don't even have any questions. She was taken into custody and charged with false swearing and obstruction before being transported to Cobb County Jail. Man, you don't want to hear that shit. Now it's too late. You going to jail? You going to jail? You going to jail? Okay. You can need a bag? I got a bag. Okay. She feeling stupid as hell now. Like, damn, I was like this close to freedom. And I wanted to, you know what I'm saying? Be a little slick motherfucker. And now I'm going to jail. Let me go home. Let me go home. Let me go home! Yeah, yeah, I got you. Let me go home, please! I will never come back here! I will never come back here! Please, just take me to my car! Starting miles, 32652. That's worse, 203. Let me go home! Just let me go to my car. I'll never come back here again. I promise. Please. <laughs> Up there that you causing hell. How you how you gonna tell your boyfriend? Cause she just said her boyfriend. How you gonna tell your boyfriend that you got locked up at your sugar daddy house causing hell? But I guess he could be in on it too. You know what I'm saying? But um, you just messed up a lick. Get your shit together. You know what I'm saying? And um, fellas, stay away from these crazy chicks like that. I know. Don't even get in there. Cause once you get in there, it might be hard to get out of there. You know what I'm saying? So. Man, stay away from these crazy chicks. Definitely, if they like to be hitting on you and stuff like that, don't allow that, man. That hitting on anybody, women, man, anybody, like, it shouldn't be allowed. But, till next time, yes, sir.